What is up everybody? So this is our eight question series on word problems. These are eight questions you absolutely must know for the PSAT, SAT, and ACT. Let's get into it. All right, so this question is designed specifically for us to make a silly mistake, so we have to be careful. It says, wrap sales increased 20% from October to November. They increased 50% from October to December. What was the percent increase in wrap sales from November to December? All right, so first things first, we do have that percentage question without a starting value. So what do we always start with? Good, 100. So now, let's work with this. We're gonna say 100 is our starting value. Where do we start? It says that wrap sales increased from October to November, so our first place is October. That's gonna be our 100. Now we increase 20% from then to November, and here's the great thing, right? If we're increasing by 20% and we're dealing with 100, 20% of 100 is just that number, it's 20, and so that's how much we're increasing. So we do 100 plus 20 brings us to 120 for November. Now, let's read the next part carefully. They increased 50% from October to December. So look at that. We're starting again from October and then we're going to December and it's an increase of 50%. So again, we're starting with 100 and what happens? We increase 50%. What's 50% of 100? It's just 50. So what do we have? 100 plus 50 is 150 for December. Now, this again is really important. Let's focus in on what it's asking. What was the percent increase in wrap sales from November to December. Look at that. We're comparing from November to December. And what are the numbers there? 120 and 150, okay? So what are we gonna do to deal with that? This is really important, okay? When we're dealing with a percent increase, here's how you do it. It's the absolute value of the difference over our starting value times 100. So let's look at that. So in this case, what's the difference here? What's the difference? We had 120, then we went to 150. How much change is that? 150 minus 120 is 30, so that's what's gonna go on top. And then what do we have on the bottom? In this case, what was our starting value? Where did we begin? 120, because we're starting with November. So we have 30 over 120, and then what do we do? We multiply by 100. So 30 over 120 simplifies to 1 fourth, which then breaks down to 0.25, we multiply by 100, we move the decimal two places, what do we get? 25%, answer choice C. All right guys, thank you so much for hanging out with me. Make sure to watch the rest of the videos in this series to get the help that you need for the PSAT, SAT, and ACT, and make sure to check out our other series. And if you haven't already, like and subscribe, because this is obviously the best thing that's ever happened in SAT prep. <laughs> Here we go. And I like yeah. love it, I think yeah. that's the one.